Okay, Stream Elements bot is hating me today. It's not working. Hi, Mac. Welcome in. Why are you haunting? I didn't... I didn't say anything. Let's see. Yeah, stream elements broken. Broken, 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 broken. Oh, you can listen on your walk. We're at the bus station. I hope your appointment goes well today, Mac. I forgot it's Monday, isn't it? I am very tired, cause... <laughs> Story time! <laughs> You're on the bus? Dude, Twitch eats up so much of my mobile data, I can't watch, like... Any Twitch when I'm not home. It makes me sad. You got the big bus? Holy... No more short bus for you? <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, you know the buses that have, like, the accordion section in the middle? Those ones scare me so much. I've only ridden those, like, a few times. But, like, stepping over, like, the, the accordion part is scary. I don't pay for my phone, and I've got unlimited. Dude, that's the props of being on your parents' plan, right? I've been trying to tell my sister to get off of her parents' plan. And she's finally gonna do that. You've never been on an accordion bus? Well, oh, okay, okay. You know how in movies, how you see people, like, walking in between, like, um, train carts? And there's, like, an open section? And you gotta kind of walk on the little metal plank in between the train carts? It's kind of like that, but on a bus. But it's not outside. <laughs> it's just kind of shaky. Hi, Kim. Welcome in. Welcome in. It's always fun. Yeah, I guess my adrenaline pump it makes me feel alive. Oh, I also- I'm gonna post probably a new speed painting every week starting next Monday. Um, until the new painting launch, everybody. Do you guys wanna hear a leak? You guys wanna hear the monologue? Yeah, last time I was there was Friday, wasn't it? Feels like ages, huh? Yes? Yes, sir? <laughs> I think yes, sir is the funniest thing. When was that, like, popular to say? I can't remember. Okay, I'll leak some of the monologue. Let's see. I'll have to pull it up on my phone. Hello, everybody, if you're just coming in, I am giving a sneak peek of my- Oh, it's actually on the phone, okay. I keep on forgetting that I'm not on, like, camera. Unless- <gasps> Guys, I'm alive, hello. Good morning, I mean, oops, good afternoon, good evening, hope everyone is doing well today. It's currently 1.05 p.m. Um, I was gonna go live a bit earlier today, but I spontaneously- I was gonna save this for the main channel tomorrow, but I didn't want the cookies to go stale. Everybody look. Everybody look. I have cookies! Because I finally caved and I downloaded the Crumbles app. And, because they require you if you order online to like put your contact information in. And apparently, it automatically signs you up for the rewards program. So I had like $10 in store credit that's only redeemable in the app. Because I've spent like... Because for every $100, you get $10 in credit, so that means I've spent like $100 in cookies that I just didn't realize. So I got, essentially, free cookies today. Because I opened the app, because like every Monday, <laughs> every Monday, I just check, I just check to see what the flavors are. Oh my god, I saw like, on the Canadian Crumble, they have like a peach cookie, and that looks fucking delicious. But we can't get it because we're in America. Anyway, so I got on the bus really early, and I got some cookies. So today, I got my sister the basic ass... Um, sugar and chocolate chip because she's a little wimp but I have the strawberry cake which you've tried on stream before and they have this banana uh, crumble I don't know what the fuck it's called so blind taste test everybody this looks like paint but I tried like a little bit of these like little crumbly thingies it's like crystallized sugar it has like banana flavoring and it. it's really good because I, when I cut the cookies I tasted it a little bit but it's good. Apparently, this cookie is banana flavored too. Can I have a bite? 
You said you're audio listening, so you can't even look at it, so no. Boom! Oh, wait, it's actually pretty good. Imagine banana bread, but not as heavy. That one's actually really good. I know I like this one. This is my favorite. I talked to the worker there for like a solid five minutes. Because she was telling me, she's like, you have two jobs. And da da da. And I'm like, yeah, you, that was me too. Wait, so I talked to her for a little bit. I didn't have any cash to tip though. I felt real bad. But next time I go, I'll tip them good. Hmm. So I'll be nibbling on this. You also become besties? <laughs> That'd be epic, wouldn't it? You're always flirting with the workers? Um, you know, I'm lonely. I'm lonely. <laughs> okay, you guys want to hear a little sneak peek of the monologue? I, I can't show it because I show my phone. Okay. So I recorded footage for the um, Rose of Teardrop painting. It's the Rainbow Circle one. And there's no, like, significance of the monologue subject with the painting. It's just, like, whatever painting I do first and then whatever monologue I have written. Two phones, two laptops, yes. I heard a rumor piece try to dash her door. What does dash mean? I, what? Okay, I picture meaning, like, steal or trying to smash. And I never see my DoorDash drivers because I always do the drop-off option. I mean, smash. I mean, they're either probably like teenagers or like crusty old 40-year-olds who have no life. So I wouldn't try to smash either. Okay, monologue. So I'll just read the whole thing out. Tell me if you guys think it's good. If it's bad, uh, just put L's in chat. Um, this monologue is called Don't Live With Regret. Let's pause the music. It's, just, it's actually distracting me. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna try and like say it in the cadence too. Oh my god, hi Keelan, welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Okay. Dude, this like slam poetry hour. This is so weird about the music now. <clears throat> okay. I try my best not to live with regrets. It can be hard, but it's the only thing that can keep me sane sometimes. When I'm faced with any decision, no matter how big or small, my mind cycles through every possible outcome and quickly arrives upon what I feel is best. I tend to place others' feelings over mine, but sometimes I say the wrong thing. In the moment, I spiral in my head and frantically try to mend any wounds I made, but I don't let that doubt build. I don't, al I don't allow it to sit and fester and make my guts new home. I hyper-rationalize my decisions so my thoughts don't need me alive. Yet those bad interactions pop up randomly in my head days or months later, but I don't entertain those thoughts. The me of the past thought it was right, thought it was the right decision, and the me of the present stands strong and acknowledges it was wrong, and I now know what the right thing to do is, so I won't make those mistakes again. And that's what growing up is meant to be, facing your past, learning, and moving on. Oh no, th this is like draft, final draft. It, it's kind of like, I don't know, it's, it was hard for me to, because this topic, I could, I had like a, I had to condense it down to a minute. Like, if I had, like, the full length, it would have been, like, two. But for YouTube shorts, you have to do a minute. We love self-growth. Yes, sir. It was nice. I think I want to, like, put more wording into, like, the... Yeah, everybody snap. Everybody snap. Peace, I too snap. <laughs> I want to put more wording into, like, the, 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 the spiraling part. Because I think that's important. But, yeah, that's a uh, draft... Final draft for the monologue we're gonna record this week. That way you can upload new videos every week on at peace and underscore art on TikTok. So guys, you the stream elements is broken today, but find me on TikTok, guys, please. Oh, it's in my Twitch about section. If you can't find it in chat. Okay, let us get started, everybody. Oh wait, I just realized since stream elements is broken, we're not gonna have the time to commands. You know where it's like. Yes, the clickbait is- or the title is not clickbait kick W. That's like my favorite thing to say. <laughs> Damn it! Okay, it's fine. So today, we are continuing our 
Dictionary, Caligraphy Journal, yes, the title is real. I'm writing every single word in the dictionary in one single stream. I'm that is actually going to split into a hundred streams over the next, like, ten years. Last week, we finished off with aerophobia, which is fear of flying. A, B, C, D, E. A, B, C, D, E. Oh, there's actually not a lot of A, E words. So we're currently on page 13. I mean, number 12. I haven't streamed in a few days, I'm rusty. Dude, I posted a clip, <laughs> I think it was this morning on TikTok, and it was me saying, I'm sad on the days where I don't stream. And some bozo commented, no friends, skull emoji, crying face emoji. And then I said, lamao, true. And then they replied with, that's so sad. <laughs> crying face emoji. I know they were ragging on me from the start, but I decided to delete that last one because I was like, ah, I feel like people are gonna fight if I leave it up. Oh no. Because, like, I know people will shit on you to goof and gaff or just to get their little angst out. I don't mind it too much as long as they're not being, like, too mean. Also, does anybody know the music we're listening to today? If you guess correctly, I will give you. A million dollars. <laughs> hashtag real hashtag not clickbait. Let's zoom in a little bit. Whoa. Nope. What? Are you guys all clueless? I'm sure once I say it, you guys will figure it out. It starts with an O. And it's not your mama. <laughs> um, music? That, that is correct, but not the answer I'm looking for. It's kind of like when you fill out like the story problems in school and you put like a smart ass answer and the teacher writes a note. It's like, jackass, that's not what the question is asking. Except the teacher does not write jackass. I do wish teachers were allowed to be more, like, blunt and frank. I think it'd be hilarious. Today's color palette is, uh, by visibility, everybody, because next month is Pride Month! Who's excited? I'm not going to any Pride parades because I don't want to be hate crimed. I don't know. Washington is pretty safe for the most part. Teachers are mad mean. I feel like teachers are either, like, really fucking mean or way too nice. I'm not- I don't care. <laughs> I've always wanted to go, but I don't have anybody to go with. All my queer friends are, like, online. <laughs> okay, first word of the day, everybody. Wait, what does the bi flag look like? It's- I think it's blue- someone has- <laughs> It's pink, purple, blue. I was close. Pink, all right. Pink, purple, blue. Pink, purple, blue. I'm a straight gay person. I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You know, I was thinking about this the other day because there's a few houses that I pass on my bus route like every day that have like the Blue Lives Matter flags. And there's so many different variations of like the Blue Lives Matter flag, right? Some being like more centrist and some being more right wing. Like, you know, the the, the fire, fire the firemen one. Anyway, you know how all the fucking Republicans shit on the queer people for making so many different flags? Or where they're just like, why can't you just make one gay pride flag, right? But then, them with all their little Blue Lives Matter flags, which I think is worse, because it's literally altering, like, the American flag. Like, if you think about it, that's, that's, for me, to me, it's, like, defaming the American flag. I don't know. It's 
kind of weird to me. Okay, chat is on screen. It just it glitched for a second. Republicans are gay. <laughs> no, I think a lot of it is her press shit. Like, honestly, I think it is. Okay, back to work. Aeroplane. A variation of airplane. I came home from work to us having a kitten. Oh my god, that's my literal dream. Wait, unless do you want a cat? If not, then that's awkward. But that's great. The kittens are a handful though. But they're adorable. What's he look like? Or what's it look like? I wish kittens could stay kittens forever. Okay, have you seen the breeders who try to breed like kittens and dogs? Like the little teacup versions? It's so psychotic. Because they essentially breed them to be disabled. It's really sad. So, guys, always adopt from shelters if you can. Aerosol. <laughs> Suspicion? Or suspension of a fine solid or liquid particles in gas. Her name is Sadie? Wait, my- One of my sister's friends who used to live down the street from us, her dog was named Sadie. And we didn't like Sadie because she would always like jump and lick us, which we hated. That's such a cute name, though. <clears throat> Aerospace. The Earth's atmosphere and the space beyond. Your dog's name is Addison? I never met an Addison, but we used to have in elementary, there's two Madisons in our class. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna do pink, purple, blue. I'm just gonna alternate all three. Before that, I'm gonna have some of my cookie. I think the strawberry cream cheese icing is the best thing ever that's been made on this whole earth. I'm not even joking. Having an aerial quality. Oh, well, I'm also using my Cali art pens. I'm using colors that I don't use. Because I have like four sets. Because every time like my lime green dies, I have to buy a new set. Because they don't sell them individually. So I have like four of these purples, five of these blues, three of these pinks. So I was like, I'll just use whatever random ass color. I don't want to bust my nice tombos for the Never ending dictionary stream. Just 
Scam? What? I would... No, I would never scam. Never ever. Also, if you guys don't guess where this music is from by the end of the stream, I'm never streaming again. Not even joking. You guys have to know what this is. Real fans would know. Oh, it's a scam. You have to buy a whole pack. Well, Cali isn't like a fancy brand. It's just some like... It's probably some <laughs> like copycat brand from China. <laughs> so it's not like poppin'. Space for the Unbound? No. But this song actually does sound like it could be from the soundtrack, but it's not. I've never heard this word in my life. Oh my god, thank you for the follow! I appreciate it. Can we get some yos? Thank you for the follow. Guys, plus one, everybody. And this is... Astolit. I have no idea how to say this. This is... A person having or affecting sensitivity to beauty. Me when I see Chatter's moms. <laughs> Cause she's beautiful, not anything else. Mm -mm. I will never insult your moms. to aesthetics. Oh, wow. So when they have the word in the definition, it's literally the dumbest shit. Appreciative of the beautiful. Very nice. Aesthetic is a word that I can never remember how to spell. Why does it have the H? It makes no sense. Aesthetics. A brand of philosophy dealing with the nature, creation, and appreciation of beauty. Okay, that's a lot prettier than I thought it was going to be. Oh, I was going to run an idea by you guys. So, my goal ideally during summertime, if I can physically handle it, is to go live on the main channel three to four times a week and then go live on this channel one to two times a week so we can still do weekly calligraphy because it's you know more chill visually pleasing and then for the second weekly time slot because i'm thinking like mondays and fridays for the art channel maybe for the second time slot maybe we can do zen doodling and to make it fancy we can spin a wheel for different colors for different shapes for different um, forms. So, like, I can do designs that are only lines, designs that are only circles, triangles, diamonds, squares. Because they're, or, like, floral. I think that'd be fun. Because, like, I have a sketchbook that's, like, this big. Uh, four by six. That way I can fill, like, a a three by five rectangle. That could be, like, two hours of stream. 
I think that would be a good setting. That way, because, like, when you do Zen Dueling, it's a nice way to warm up and also, like, loosen up and not be scared to make mistakes. And also get some, like, more abstract pattern work down. It's kind of like more controlled doodling. Okay, this pink looks like salmon on camera, but I swear it's more like pinky. Etiology, which is the British variation of etiology. Wow. Okay, that's one page done. No resets yet. Time for a new page. You know what else it's time for? Time for me to tell you if you're new here, follow the channel. Um, if you follow, you get nothing yet, but you do get to tap in chat after 10 minutes. Can we hit our follower goal? We only got, we already got one follower today. That's rare, so thank you. Can we get four more? Smile. Wait, how many, do, guys, do you have 69 followers? Because I think before I started stream, I was at 68. No way. <laughs> Easy. Also, if you could, exclamation shop in chat. It doesn't work. Sad. Um, if you visit peaceandart.myshopify, you can buy my original artwork. I make paintings. Smile. We finally hit the AF words. Capital A, capital F. Abbreviation for the Air Force or audio frequency. or to a great distance. A F Bay Air Force Base. Abbreviation. A F C. Abbreviation for American Football Con Conference or Automatic Frequency Control. And that was the final word on page twelve. Speed running today, starting page number thirteen. They say. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing the British accent whenever I'm doing letters. <laughs> I'm sorry. AFDC. The aid to families with dependent children.
affable. Courteous and agreeable to conversation. So, a pushover. Any pushovers in chat? Type one. <laughs> okay. Ooh, this next word is scandalous. dotted the A instead of the I. I have a whiteout pen? Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Run is not ruined. Affair. Gasp! Something that relates to it, to or involves one. A romantic or sexual attachment of limited duration. I was just saying fuck somebody else when you're married. Easy. We hate affairs. Okay, I'm gonna have to do lots of white on that. or wearing to pretend that an attitude or behavior is gener genuine. What? Oh, there's a lot of definitions. Okay. To produce an effect on or an observable display of emotion. I never heard of that in my life. I don't think the whiteout's gonna work. I say we leave it there because it's charming. Another page done. Let's go. Affectation. An attitude or behavior that is assumed by a person but not genuinely felt. Ooh, so when you say I love you but you don't actually? Gasp. Scandalous. I'm gonna try it. Okay, because I hate having to turn my head to look to have the mic pick me up better, so I moved it over here. It only casts a shadow on my book, which is fine. Not ideal, but it's fine. Back to work. Affected. Given or marked by affectation. Artificially assumed to pr impress others.
Reflecting. Arousing pity, sympathy, or sorrow. Oh, I didn't cross there. A tender attachment to Effective. Relating to influencing or expressing an emotion or feeling. Emotional. Afferent. Bearing or conducting inward towards a more central part, especially the nervous system. What? My back pain is afferent. <laughs> oh my god, hi Emmy! Can we get some meows? Hello. Opening wall today, man. Are you at work? Are you watching on your phone under the desk? Shame on you. But also, we're, uh, you know, dilly dally in the company time. That's great. Fine. This purple is already busted. Sadly. To promise oneself or another in marriage. What? Should be a finance, am I right? You guys, get a prenup. Affidavit. A sworn statement in writing. When you guys type in the chat, you've made an affidavit to give me all your prime subs. On the main channel, not this channel. And that's another page done. Three pages done in 41 minutes? Not bad. Not bad at all. Surely we'll finish the, the run today, right? Right? <laughs> Lulus. Affiliate. 
an associative as a member or branch. Also, if you get 50 followers and 3 average viewers, you can become an affiliate on Twitch. Wow. I don't... I still don't think I'll get affiliate on this channel. I could if I wanted to. Like, if I just streamed. Because I think I average, like, 6 viewers on this channel. Which is pretty good. But I'd rather have all my monetization and sub subs go towards the main channel. I want a cookie. Cookie break. This banana cookie is a lot better than I anticipated. I didn't expect it to be as this banana-y. It is really undone, though. Underdone. Okay. This morning, I was watching, like, a comp. It's like, why crumble is bad? And it's just, like, videos and clips of, like, people posting, like, poorly made cookies or, like, food safety hazards. But it's, like, getting plastic... Or shit in your food is normal. It happens everywhere you go. You just gotta be careful. And like, if you taste something funny, don't swallow it, obviously. <gasps> Gasp. The song. But, for me... My main concern with food... Or not food, but like... Criticizing a company is like the work practices. Like... The product is gonna be mishaps, there's gonna be misprints, but like, if they're mistreating workers, uh-oh. There was one clip <laughs> where they look like there was like a 10-year-old working the register. <laughs> that obviously is bad, but I would need more context. Because you know how in like the mom and pop shops you see like a little 10-year-old at the register? And it's like the kid. I don't think that's right, but it's different than like hiring minor. I think this is the song from the final battle. Wait, I can't say what the music's from. Yeah, it is the final song. Sag. Back to work. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I'll explain this again. Affinity. Kinship, relationship, an attractive force. <laughs> okay, when I saw this word, I thought it said alinity. <laughs> and guys, I'll be honest, I think alinity is the prettiest, like, woman alive. No joke. I think she's fucking beautiful. I watch her stream sometimes. I do peep at our Twitter occasionally. I don't follow. <laughs> I just look. She is so pretty. She's also really funny, too. And we love sex workers.
Oh. Wait, what? No, this is the right height. I thought I made this this line the wrong height, but it's fine. Getting out, getting in my own head. Affinity card. <clears throat> a credit card issued in affiliation with an organization. So, my business credit card? That I don't have yet, don't worry. I need to garner money before I get a business card. <laughs> to assert positively. Asserting that the fact is so positive. Roger. Affirmative. <laughs> Isn't that what you see on the walkie talkies? An active effort to improve the employment or educational opportunities of members of minority groups and women. I used to not like affirmative action. Like, learning it in school, it had a very, like, negative slant. But I feel like that type of legislation was important because it forced companies and universities to enroll in higher minorities. When otherwise, they probably wouldn't have. So I think... Because a lot of the slant was like, oh, affirmative act action is racist because you're excluding white people now. But it's like, you need to hit certain demographic quotas that way that you can have adequate diversity and representation in the workplace. So, on paper, it seems kind of scum, but it's necessary because society still hasn't evolved enough to the point where minorities aren't denounced. Smile. Oh, no politics. This is an art channel. A fix. To attach or add. I've never heard this word in my life. <laughs> what is this? I'm gonna be so smart after this challenge. A flag. 
Atlantis. Divine inspiration. I've, ne I've literally never heard this word in my whole life. That's another page done. There's so many double F words, I just realized. There's almost like three whole pages. Damn. <laughs> Afflict. To cause pain or distress to. Causing affliction or distressing. Distressing. Affluence. Abundant supply. Or wealth. If you come from an affluent background, you can afford many things. Or nothing that'll save your parents' marriage. <laughs> Sorry, that was too mean, too mean. Too real. Afford. To manage to bear the cost without serious harm or loss. Afforestation. The act or process of establishing a forest. So the opposite of deforestation. So I hate afforestation. Fright. Frighten or alarm. Sad. It's a good ending, EP.
confront. Insult or confront. Afghan hound. Any of a breed of tall, slim, swift hunting dogs with a coat of silky thick hair and a long, silky top knot. <coughs> oh, there's another one. Actually, never mind. <laughs> you know what else is coming your way? Um, nothing, because I don't have ads on this channel, but. If you do exclamation shop or peach, okay, it's not. If you check out peace and art on my shop provider.com, you can check out my original artwork. I sell paintings. Wow. Also, we're another 30 minutes in. So if you're new here, um, follow the channel. You get to type in chat. Can we hit our follower goal today? I think we can. Yes, sir. <laughs> this sounds like the conspiracy music sound you see on TikTok. <laughs> it's like. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'm just checking something really quick. Gucci. I didn't cross the F up here. Oh, also, since I don't have Amazon Prime anymore, the VODs on this channel are only public on Twitch for a week now. Which is fine, because I don't think many people watch back the VODs on this channel. But all VODs from this channel will be archived on the Peace in 17 VODs channel on YouTube. Because, like, another reason why I want to try stream two weeks, days a week here is I don't want people clicking on this channel and seeing that there's no videos. So it kind of forces you to stream multiple times a week for people to see that you have an active catalog. Which is fine, but not ideal for people who are taking, like, extended breaks. That's why I hate how they made videos will delete themselves after only a week. Kind of D-U-M. Okay, let's do something more poppin'. Want to make the switch to Shopify? Here's how to what? do it in a few easy What the steps. fuck? Sign Why up. am I getting ads? What? <laughs> what? It logged me out of YouTube. That is BS. What the fuck? Dude, why would it log me out? I was literally just logged in. No, I do not want to take a survey. This is stupid. I just want to listen to my my Ludwig Sonic music. Play. There we go. Why? I literally was just- <laughs> Why did it kick me? Okay, remember how they used to have on YouTube? Only one account could be logged in. Because I remember I would try to like watch YouTube on my computer. And then I would go to YouTube on my phone and it would kick me out. And it would ban me for a little bit. 
but I'm so glad that they let you log in on multiple devices now. It's so much easier. Aficionado. A devotee or a fan. So, all the little cake pop people on Twitter? Oh, like they're fixated on something. Okay, that makes sense. Or on the field, away from home, out of the way, astray. The fire. Being on fire for morning. AFL, the American Football League. I have never once had an interest in football. Like, literally never. I think it's because it's like so violent. I think it's also because my dad or neither of my parents were big into sports, so there was never any sports like playing on the TV when I was young. A flame. Burning. C-I-O. The American Federation of Labor and Congress, and Congress of Industrial Organizations. So, are they anti-union? As if on the water. That's the only thing I know to do. I, I can only float, I can't swim. I just sink whenever I try. So that page done? Excited. A 
foot. On foot or in action or in progress. I'm gonna swap out this purple because it's already busted. like the big olive balloon about salmonella and whenever you go to a restaurant and you get like a over easy egg they're like gosh you might die if you consume raw egg but actually go look it up what does salmonella do Okay, salmonella. Most people with salmonella infections have diarrhea, fever, and stomach cramps. Symptoms usually between six, range between six hours to six days after infection. And can last four to seven days. However, some people do not develop symptoms for, for, for several weeks after infection and others experience symptoms for several weeks. Um, so you basically just shit your brain down. Oh, so it's like a... Oh wait, can salmonella kill you? Let's see. Okay, so it affects your intestinal lining, so it's usually more hazardous for young people, infants, older adults, transplant recipients, pregnant women, and people with weakened immune systems. So if you're healthy, you'll be fine, but if you're immunocompromised, then it's kind of like it could harm you. What? Moral mortality rate for treated cases is 2%. Okay, that's kind of high. Um. Monka W. Maybe, maybe I should. <laughs> no, nah, 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 nah. I'm still gonna eat my little raw eggs. I love them too much. I just. I, th I think I have to actually, like, start praying. To not get a bad egg. <laughs> also, you get get sick from raw flour too. Eight shutters. I have to take the call.
I had, I had a call from DSHs. Because I, oh my god, I got so annoyed. Thank you guys for waiting. I, I had to take that call. Um, because I talked with an agent on like May 2nd. And then they had to get like medical consent forms where that, that way they can like call my doctors and shit and verify that I am disabled. And they didn't get that paperwork until the 15th. So we're waiting on my doctor's evals, and that could take two weeks. Sad face. So I... Because there's no way for me to access some information online. Like, I have to call the fucking hotline to figure it out. So I called earlier today. I like, not. Nah, I called several times. Because, like, sometimes when you call the Washington DSHS, it's like, We will transfer you now. And then it'll dial for a minute, and they're like, there are no agents available. Please call back at a later time. And then it hangs up on you, which is bullshit. So it did that to me several times, and then I had to leave a message with that specific department to reach out to me. And that was at... I left a voicemail at 10 a.m. So, damn. It should not have taken up them that long to get back to me. But you know what? Mondays are a busy day. Because that's usually when more people, most people, like have to call to verify their cash benefits, because some benefits you do have to call every week to verify. So, yeah, I had to take it. So guys, that means I probably won't get any disability for May, let's go! Sad. It was fine. You know what, today's a good day, I have cookies. <laughs> They had a banana cookie with the strawberry cream cheese icing. Holy shit, that would go crazy. Wait, let me try that real quick. Put me in the test kitchen. Okay, I have the banana cookie with the strawberry icing. Okay, the strawberry is a bit strong. But the banana cookie with cream cheese would go crazy. I wonder if anybody who works at like Crumble will make like whack ass cookie combos on their own. It's gonna happen. I feel like everybody does that at food service. Like if they get a wild sandwich or a crazy cookie pizza. Like a cookie like crazy, not cookie. to work. No more time off task. I work for Amazon. mentioned mentioned previously named before.
Afterthought. Planned beforehand or premeditated. Murder? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I still really like true crime content. I'm trying to wean myself off of it though. Because I fully understand the argument of it ex like exploiting the stories of traumatized individuals. I fully agree with it. But it's still like interesting. I, I think a good way to mitigate that is like if it's somebody who doesn't do interviews or hasn't like published anything about their story, if they kept the names anonymous. But then it's also like, should they cover stories that are unsolved? Because I feel like there's been some cases to where they'll post or somebody will share a true crime story that's unsolved and then little freaks on the internet figure it out. And that's kind of good. I don't know. Maybe I should just stop consuming. Okay, this one is two words. Theory. And the stronger argument with even greater reason. So, debate lords. A foul of in or in conflict with. Okay. That is page number 13 done. Doing pretty good. <laughs> AFR, abbreviation for Africa or African. Frightened or fearful. Be afraid. A frame. A building having triangular front and rear walls with the roof reaching to the ground. It's like a tent, but a house. I feel like that'd be claustrophobic. Skip words that relate to identity. Like African, Asian, like all those type of words. Not that they're bad words. 
should I keep him in? I don't know. Because it's not like the words themselves are bad. I'll keep it in. or inhabitant of Africa. African American. An American of African descent. Africanized bee. A highly aggressive hybrid honeybee accidentally produced from Brazilian and African stocks that has spread from Southern America to Mexico and the southern US. We hate illegal importing because it leads to animals and pests being in regions that they shouldn't be. Cookie break. Okay, I do think. They made the banana cookie with cream cheese icing. I'd go there every day. Just kidding, I'm weird. My sister did say she would help pay for a gym membership for me. So I'll maybe start that next month. Then I would just have to take the bus. Which is fine. I honestly love taking the bus everywhere. It makes me feel like my tax dollars are at work.
African Violet. A tropical African plant widely grown indoors for its velvety, fresh, fleshy leaves and showy purple, pink, or white flowers. Afrikaans, a language developed from 17th century Dutch that is one of the official languages of the Republic of South Africa. Another page done. I think I'll stream for two hours today. Oh, we're an hour 30, so if you're new here, follow the channel. You can dive in chat <laughs> and hang out with everybody. You can also Hit up, hit our follow goal. Can we get four more followers today? I think we can do it. Also, you can do an exclamation shop and check out peaceinart.myshopify.com. I sell original paintings. Wow. style of tight curls and a full evenly rounded shape. My dad used to have an afro. Because he has really, really curly hair. But if I let my hair like loose and don't style it, it looks like I have a lion's mane. A fake afro. I'm also gonna get more water real quick. I'll be right back. Smile. Downstairs to get some water. Sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> I heard my order fan. The biggest box outside. Time to bring it up. There's a bag. <laughs> I 
I mean, that'll work off the cookie I got, right? Afro-American. An African-American. AFT, an abbreviation for near or toward. The AFT capitalized the American Federation of Teachers. After birth, the placement and membranes of a fetus that are expelled <laughs> after childbirth. Yeah, that's not <laughs> so placenta. I didn't... I didn't. Usually, I read the definitions before I write it, that way I can make sure it's safe. And I thought this one was fine, so I just thought it meant like, like literally after birth. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm a true. After burner. A device incorporated in the tailpipe of a turbojet engine for injecting fuel into the hot exhaust gases and burning it to provide extra thrust. Afterburner. or treatment of a patient. Also, you should do it after you smash. Next page!
Oh my god, Ludwig's song! <laughs> After deck. The rear half of the deck of a ship. I got a crumb on my paper, but you can't even see it. Not even there. Okay, this word could go crazy. Because whenever I cross um, T's and F's, if they, let's say there was a T at the end of this, I wouldn't go all the way because I don't like cutting through tall letters. But see, F, T, F, F, T are the only long letters. So I can do a long stroke here. There we go. Look at that. A rare. After effect. An effect that follows its cause after an interval. After glow. Glow remaining where light has disappeared. Like my heart. After image. <clears throat> Visual sensation continuing after the stimulus causing it has ended. What? <laughs> Sounds weird. Sussy. So we're in like this one, as I was saying earlier, since it's an F, T, L, F for tall letters, I'm not going to go all the way through. I don't want to cross the L. So if you cross through tall letters that aren't meant to be crossed through, then it looks confusing, I know. Afterlife. An existence after death. I don't believe in an afterlife. I do like the idea of, like, reincarnation. I think that's really cute. Like, the idea of having, like, a part of you or your consciousness. A part of the new world. I think it's cute. I'm also, like, agnostic, so... You can believe what you want to believe. Result outcome. Between noon and evening. Good evening, Governor. 
to shave. The scented lotion for the face after shaving. So now the page is done. I think I'll do maybe one of each page. Depending on how long it takes. Because I want to hit two hours today. Gotta grind those hours. Grinding for affiliate. Oh, let's change the title. Dude, whenever people post like, ooh, grinding for affiliate, ooh, grinding for partner, it's so cringe. It also makes you seem like like a fake-ass bitch. You should want to get to that those pedestals naturally. We shouldn't bait people into following or something. Oh my god. Unless something substantial happens, like a sub -thon. Like, if I'm a new viewer, cookie break, and I see that your stream title is the first ever stream that I see from you, is a, ooh, affiliate grinder, ooh, partner grind, it just makes you seem like all you care about is the status, not the actual content. Controversial, but true. I think that's because I consumed a lot of stream content before I streamed. So I feel like if you stream yourself, you have to understand how viewers perceive it, not necessarily other streamers. Because other streamers might think that type of sentiment is fine, but as a viewer, it's, it gives you an ick. And you want to have as least icks as you can. for when I'm done. These are all tall letters. Ooh, wee. That was almost perfect. That part is so straight and I curved down here for no reason. Um. <clears throat> Aftertaste. A sensation after the stimulus causing it has ended. Unlike flavor. Not anything else. After payment of taxes and especially of income tax. So us brokies will never have to deal with after tax. Great. later.
afterward. At a later time. AG symbol for silver. Capital A, capital G. Abbreviation for Adjutant General or Attorney General. Again. Once more, a new. But I spam in Hassan's chat whenever he, he ends an episode of MasterChef. Did I miss the MasterChef meta? It was my favorite React art. Or a really mad copyright holders. Against. In opposition of. Anybody against me? Type one. <laughs> okay, that's another page done. Probably the final page for today, depending if I speed run or not. Because that page took like five minutes, so maybe I could do a few more. We'll see. So, today I went to crumble. Got some cookies. Then I did meal prep. I cooked for like... I cooked for about two hours and then I cleaned for another hour because there's so many goddamn dishes. Because for meal prep, the kiddos don't like eating the same thing for multiple days in a row. So instead of cooking like every three days, I have to cook every other day. But I make two dishes. So today I made like this pan seared baked cream chicken thigh thing and then like these crispy sorry counting my lines I messed up one of the dots here and then like this crispy beef thing and I had shoyu and then maple syrup that's the sauce base and it's pretty good almost like a crispy caramelized beef Oh, right here. I skip. I skip the dot here. Yeah, so I was on my feet for a long ass time today. But both meals are pretty good because I've been trying to do um, new recipes. Nothing has really failed me yet. The gate. Unselfish, unconditional love for another. Or mouth open a wonder or surprise. I've never heard the first definition. I I gave you. I've never heard that. A gar. A jelly-like substance extracted from a red alga and used as a jelly and stabilizing like agent in foods. So, goop. It's probably in the McNuggets, right? <laughs> Wait, no, they have the pink goop.
Okay, we have a gar a gar. Which is just a gar. <laughs> I have no idea why. That is written like that. The gates. The striped or clouded quartz. I used to collect rocks. My mom used to be a crystal model. And then she stopped. Which is great. So if she stopped, I stopped. Because she was the one who would buy me rocks. <laughs> of a genus of a spiny leaved plant related to the amaryllis okay i know i say i don't know how to say this or how do i pronounce this you know how it's the pronunciations in the dictionary with little accents and tildes i don't understand it i've never understood it so when people have in their bio like how to pronounce their names i still don't understand it A-G-C-Y, abbreviation for agency. Age. The length of time during which you're being or thing has lived or existed. Don't make your age. I just turned 24. Almost a month of being 24, and I feel exactly the same. If not a bit more tired, I don't know. Maybe I'm getting old. <laughs> okay, final word, everybody. I'm ready to span all this here. Not the final word of the dictionary. No, the final word of the day. <laughs> That G is actually perfect. Age. Of advanced age or having attained a specified age. There we go. Got a lot done today. That's fine. A lot less- oh my god, I actually got a lot done. Holy moly. Get a lot of the chatters, and that's totally fine. It's a Monday. Okay, so, today, in the actual dictionary, I got through a quarter of page 12, all of page 13, and literally only one word left on page 14, so. One full page and then a quarter. Let's go! Okay, let's get a nice little flip through of what we did. We? I mean me! Don't show feet, don't show feet. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm good. Feel free to screenshot your favorite word of the day. That's all for today. How many pages did I get this? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Whoa, that's a lot. I'm actually speed running today. <laughs> okay, everybody. I would like to thank you all for watching. 
any chat as vloggers. Thank you all for hanging out today for this exclusive piece of <laughs> underscore art tree. Uh, we did get a new follow today. Thank you for the new follow. I appreciate it. Um, like I said earlier, I want to try to go live on this channel twice a week. We'll do collect a few once a week for sure. And maybe like Zen Dueling will start. Maybe that'll make a appearance on this channel this week and next week. We'll see. Depends on how my homework goes. Um, I should be live on the live ch on the main channel tomorrow with Mario Kart for more story times. And we should be starting um, a Zelda game this week. I'm not saying which one. But go check out the main channel. If you haven't already, visit Peace and Art on my channel. I probably don't gotta buy anything. All I gotta do is look, browse a little, explore what the world has to offer. Okay, stream elements still hates me. Um, Peaceinart.myshopify.com. It is in my about section. Go click it. We need to get to a billion unique clicks today. <laughs> okay, enjoy the rest of your week. I'll see you guys on the main channel later this week. Maybe this channel this week. Bye. Bye bye. I muted myself and then I said bye. <laughs> so I had to unmute and then say bye again. <laughs> Dude, those cookies have so much sugar in it. That's why I'm so zooted. I don't know.